Now we will begin part A with the first conversation. Number one. Are you enjoying your coffee? It tastes extremely bitter this morning. What does the man mean? Number two. Can you tell me how often the philosophy class meets? It meets twice a week for an hour and a half each time. What does the man mean? Number three. I'm tired of just sitting here. Relax. I'm sure that the flight will depart within a few minutes. What does the woman mean? Number four. The science project is due next week. I suppose I'll have to start working on it now. What does the man mean? Number five. I'd like to order a dozen roses. Do you deliver? Yes, we can deliver anywhere in the city by this afternoon. Where does this conversation probably take place? Number six. Did you enjoy the biology lecture? The professor droned on and on about cell division. What does the man mean? Number seven. What do I need to cash a check? I have to see a driver's license and a credit card. What does the woman mean? Number eight. Have you been able to find an apartment yet? It's difficult to find affordable housing in New York. What does the man mean? Number nine. Why were you so late in getting home from work? My boss had me finish all the month end reports. What does the man mean? Number 10. Miss Jones did not look too happy as she left her classroom. She was angered by her rowdy students. What does the woman mean? Number 11. The prices at this store are really outrageous. You can say that again. What does the man mean? Number 12. I don't like this weather very much. We haven't seen rain like this for many years. What does the man mean? Number 13. Professor Martin, what do you think of the composition that I turned in last week? Without question, you need to improve the quality of your writing. What does Professor Martin say about the student? Go on to the next page.
Number 14. Where should I go next? You must stand in this line so that the agent can check your passport. What does the man mean? Number 15. Did Paul get his work done? He couldn't finish the assignment because the library was closed. What does the woman say about Paul? Number 16. The lawyer spent hours and hours working on that case. It's true that he prepared hard for the case, but his work was for nothing. What does the man mean? Number 17. Do you know when the papers for Professor Jenkins' history class are due? They're due next week, aren't they? What does the man mean? Number 18. Are you happy with the work that the contractor did on your house? I'm rather dissatisfied with it. What does the man mean? Number 19. I can't find a typist to finish my term paper by tomorrow morning. Why not do it yourself? What does the woman suggest? Number 20. I can't get this television set connected to the cable. Oh, it's as easy as pie. What does the woman mean? Number 21. Is Bob doing a good job in the office? He never manages to turn in his budget reports on time. What does the woman say about Bob? Number 22. Has the auto mechanic told you how much work the car needs? He indicated that the repairs would be quite extensive. What does the woman mean? Number 23. Did Betty listen to what her boss said? She followed the directions to the letter. What does the man mean? Number 24. How's Walter doing in his new business? Well, he hasn't exactly been unsuccessful. What does the man mean? Number 25. Are you going to organize that closet this morning? I wish I didn't have to. What does the man mean? Number 26. Did Sally finish that difficult assignment? She gave up before she really got started. What does the woman say about Sally? Go on to the next page.
Number 27. What did Peggy say about the job I did? She couldn't have said nicer things. What does the man say about Peggy? Number 28. Your new secretary seems to be doing a great job. Rarely did new employees take such initiative. What does the woman mean? Number 29. Did you enjoy taking care of the children all afternoon? If you had gotten here any later, I'd have been a wreck. What does the man mean? Number 30. I just got back from the market. So you did do the shopping. What had the woman assumed about the man? This is the end of Part A. Go on to the next page.